Do you have any family on family stuff? It's okay. A few years ago, I would have given you the same look. I, I, okay, I'm sorry. I'm going to have to pull myself out of this park. <laughs> I'm going in and out of Michael like a cuckoo clock bird. At least my mom never tried to sleep with somebody I was dead. Oh, wait. No. Steve Holt. No, oh, but he's family. It's all an act. She's not even interested in children. Well, maybe like babies, but even that's weird because who likes babies? Mm, especially in the early years, I know. I guess I was picturing you at 16, <laughs> but I, I don't know why I do that. Lucille Bluth. Of course. Of course. Information on that case has been sealed. Well, all seals can come loose with a little bit of gentle pressure. And honestly, if I wanted a hairless lover, I'd probably go underage rather than overage, you know? What's that? Who knows what makes a guy think he can pass for straight? I mean, if he really is gay, he can try to hide it, but trust me, it will come out in the most unexpected balls. I mean, I can't let the guy see me naked, because... Not to brag, but, you know, there's not a lot of 75-year-old women who've got a body like this, you know? I don't think that's bragging. The problem was, like you said, that we couldn't be together without branding each other's taint. No, it's uh, tainting each other's brand, but same diff. I think I see where you're going with this. An incredibly attractive, incredibly rare and precious gem. And then I open my mouth and I have these rotted out meth teeth. And I'm like, then why do I gotta f my cousin for some meth money, mom? You know, or something like that? I feel like we're circling it. Yeah. So, what do you think? It used to be a two hour teeth. Hold, please. Yeah, I remember the screams. Guess it was the 90 minute tooth guys across the street that put the two hour guys out of business. But I did see that the old blockbuster is now becoming an hour mouth. So those guys gotta be shitting themselves. The only contact George Michael had had with Rebel was watching one okay, of her David, movies with so a I'll Shane and three cat. Noahs. And you can say goodbye to these. Maybe I do miss her. Do you think so? Do you think, do you think that she's really just using you? Yeah, and I'm pretty sure it's not for his body. Oh, well, I, I mean, I don't know the guy, but I saw a picture. I think he's got a great build, you know. Um, he's wiry. You wouldn't want him to be any taller. I like the young man's body, okay? I do. <laughs> well, that's, that's very weird of you. With a sexy man. Well, I thought I was taking you out tonight. Oh, relax, you're fine. You know what, I've never really been attracted to handsome men. I offered, I'm gonna have sex. To sleep with her so that she might forget my $700,000 debt. Nice humble brag. And you act like you're expecting a booty call, as the old people think the young people say, All right? You tell her I'm just here for a quickie and I'm getting out of here. Mr. Brash, and she'll drop you like a buttered cane. Is that something old people say? Yeah, I'm trying to get it going. See, she used to be an Orange County weather girl, which is basically just tits, teeth, and ass, right? Now, she's the host of OC Can You Say, which is tits, teeth, public affairs, ass, sunlight interviews. I mean, it's so much more responsibility. He's making it sound more important than it really is. Is he? Well, the magician seems to be just standing there, doing nothing. Ah, uh, you get used to it. Well, I barely know her. Really? Because it says right here that you love her? It does, doesn't it? Yeah. You know, sorry we can love. It's the way that I say goodbye. Mm. They're already looking for you. What? The cops are looking for me? A cop, actually. I can't be talking to the cops. Listen. I don't, I don't, I don't do good with the cops. I, I didn't do anything. I don't even know what's going on. I ain't got no truck with no blue. See you later. Thank you for your service. Love you. We're ringing a bell out here in front of uh, A's Pea Soup. Ice cream. Ice cream? What's that about ice cream? No, thank you. Uh, nine danka. <laughs> Big boy, I gotta go, okay? I'll talk to you later. Love ya. Well, for starters, you could post it on dad fights. Wait, that's a thing? It's just like a bunch of guys punching their dads? Or... Yeah, well, you're supposed to say, guess what, dad, first? But then some of the dads were catching on and they were just wailing on their kids. You go watch those clips on That's What, Son. Don't, uh, you know. Why'd mommy leave, daddy? Tobias. I didn't leave, I left you both. <laughs> I don't think you want to go there, okay? Yes, 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 I suppose I did 
start too high. Okay, let's bring everyone down an octave. Why did mommy leave, daddy? Uh, goodbye. I didn't leave, Listen, I loved you both. Buddy, hey, what goodbye. about they should take all the rapists and all the murderers and put them all together on an island? And all the murderers can be raped and all the rapists can be murdered. Until, until you, you only have, have either, either two, two rapists, rapists left or you're down to one, one raped murderer, murderer who but who cares about, about him? him? Oh, was it one raped murderer? I've heard her say it both ways. I mean, in all likelihood, the guy would be raped. Maybe you don't want to get hurt because, as I say, hurt people hurt people. Oh, that's nice. I always say make people cry, make people cry. But yours includes the people who don't want to give you the satisfaction. This is what happens when you're rich and white in America. You happen to be caught on video dumping some large person type thing into the bay, and nobody thinks, I wonder how long that guy has been working for the real killer. How did you find out? It was easy. I just looked in your computer under secrets. Oh, you looked in my please don't read folder? No, that one was empty. I found it in just odds and ends. Great, so you got past my double bluff. Thanks, Addy. You can go. Thank you, Addy. <laughs> you had me come all the way down here so I could play a video off our Dropbox? Okay, evidence guy, we're done with you. Well, it's your job. No, putting on the drop box is my job. Walking them out to my parking spot? Because you guys can't admit that you don't know how to use Dropbox. That's not even his job. He's every bit as much of a detective as someone with the word detective in their title. Hey, I don't care about the evidence guy. Oh, join the club. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll take a hamburger with two tops. Why aren't we whispering? Oh, he can't hear a thing. He's got horrible aids. Oh, hearing aids? Yeah, yeah, here they call them aids. The other ones they call aids. Say what you will about Ron Howard as a filmmaker, but the man is not a Nazi sympathizer. Thanks. Maybe. Hello? I think my phone's ringing. Maybe. Hello? Come on. Maybe. Hello? Hello? It's me. I know you're not old. Can we have a system where I don't have to wait the 40 seconds? Look, I have to be careful, okay? These are not tech-savvy people. The other day, I turned the lounge TV on, and now that's my job. They call me Buttons now. Buttons! That advice you gave us, the honesty thing, it was, it was great. Thank you. The truth came out of my mouth as easy as any lie I could have thought of. She was so believable. I thought she was lying. I would like to call Lucille Bluth the accused mother. I think you mean the accused Mother. Oh, what did I say? Okay, people are gonna see you, they're gonna think, hey, here comes the next Steve Jobs, and they're gonna want, jobs. I mean, jobs for sure, but they're also gonna want money. I hate it. I just wasted an hour and a half working on an opening joke until I realized that it's from Fast and Furious. It doesn't even work unless you're in a Camaro. I mean, he's attracted to her. He's attracted to her. I'm sorry, why would he be attracted to her if he's blind? And how did he burn off his fingertips? I have no idea what you're talking about. I may have added the fingertips. I may have added the fingertips because I assume if he's blind, he's got to feel her face. Okay. But you, you said you never saw him touch her face? I never said he was blind. Oh, for God's sake, stop talking like a child. I mean, how old are you? 56 and a half. Jesus. We both have alter egos, and I think it's about time we killed them off. What do you say? George Mahara is going to have a heart attack? Maybe. Gets hit by a bus? You're killing off maybe? Yep, see ya. I know Annette can be forgetful, but she remembers that maybe is the dominant personality, right? Oh, you're not wearing that. You're running to build a house seat, not a sofa. Oh, nobody's going to build a wall. According to the succeeding New York Times, Donald Trump doesn't even have a, a chance of winning that election. Yeah. One of their slimy, cheat the system shortcuts that never works instead of postponing the trial. It was a message that was easily interpreted through the lens of one's particular bias. She's a Muslim. She's disrespecting Muslims. She's a ghost. She's disrespecting ghosts. You know, I've been in the house five minutes. You haven't even offered me so much as a pitcher of martinis. You sold the company? A little. You can't sell a company a little. That's like saying you're a little bit tired. You don't think you could be a little bit tired? My dad was going to invest in your company. I was going to invest in your company. Then suddenly you go behind my back and have sold it. You clearly don't trust me. I do trust you. I just didn't want fake block to get in the way of our relationship. Well, now it's not going to get in the way of anything. Anything? I mean, to... It's over now? A little. It makes no sense at all. But what he's basically saying is nobody wants to be naked underneath their underwear. Yeah, I, I think they were just being ironic. I mean, it's uh -huh. like a, a not surprised party. 
Like, if Buster was coming home, he'd expect a surprise party, so it wouldn't be a surprise. So since he's in jail, we're going to throw a party and not tell him about it since there won't be any guests. Yep. <laughs> well, I am surprised she went through all that trouble. <laughs> oh, so I guess it worked. Mm -hmm. Before we find a clueless buyer, I think we're going to have to find a clueless president. And it's not going to be me. You know, someone that's stupid and lazy enough that he doesn't ask any questions about the actual software. Oh, I love how you're assuming it's a he. I know what you're thinking. Look who's back. But the upside is that after this announcement, I think we're going to be able to free up some extra capital, get you some tech guys. I got some friends in mapping I can talk to when they come up for air. We are much more concerned with the software portion of the demonstration. We are very eager to see how it interferes with the broadcast. We need something like this in China. Because your game shows are the worst. <laughs> and of course, this would be very helpful in avoiding the spread of democracy. You sound just like a slightly self-aware Aunt Lindsay. Well, you sound just like a minimally woke Uncle Michael. And where are we going, Father? Nowhere. I was just practicing the new skit. Remember the line where he says, get your stuff. I'm improving, you over-intending schmachter. This is the simplest character in the entire family. He has one personality trait. He always comes back. Well, that and he always has his hands in his pockets. What, he got peanuts in there? Oh, why am I staying here for this? And, Dad, I made you a chant follower, not a chant leader. Chant follower? I'm not paying you for that. Say hello to my new right-hand man. Did somebody say I took this guy home with him after I found him next to the police station bailout? Well, that would have been better if it was his right hand. You know, Sometimes I think they spent $27 million on the wrong guy. Don't you say that about you? Well, maybe you do say that. Maybe that's important to say. I needed somebody to play a part in my fantastic for legal purposes, I can't say the rest of it, musical. It's not time to play the blame game, OK? Even though they do say, in most cases, something happens in childhood, and usually the person that raises them is to blame. But that's just the experts. I see what you're doing. Don't you try to pin this on Lupe. She had her own family to raise, too. This doesn't leave this house. All right, all right, all right. It's fine. The boy can be trusted. Are we absolutely sure about that? Why don't we let the boy speak for himself? Am I the boy? I've never heard a man ask that question. Nor have I. You know what would be a good idea, boy? Why don't you get me a Fanta on your way out of the family? It's in the fridge. I don't know what's happening. 